Hi, I'm Jacinta and today I am going to make a butterfly garden. I'm so excited to make this. I just have this beautiful vision in my head. So many butterfly models and flowers and I'm going to finally use the nuptial bell in the middle, I'm thinking. I think this is gonna be really pretty. And I'm going to make it on this little island here, which was a little picnic spot, but I figured I've got enough picnic spots on my island. So yeah, I'm gonna change this into a butterfly garden. And this is why my island is never going to be finished because all I do is rework old areas. But anyway, let's get started. Oh, and also I have jumped ahead to spring because I think that's the season I want to set my dream address in when I finally finish. And yeah, spring is just so beautiful. I think it works the best of my island. So first I'm gonna clear off all these items that I'm not gonna use anymore. Goodbye picnic spot. You'll be remembered by the 10 other picnic spots I have around my island. I think I want to attempt my first diagonal bridge for this build. Hopefully it's not too hard. Hopefully I can make it work. I've tried for four and I gave up. So let me go demolish this bridge and then I'll try put a new one in. Okay, the bridge has been demolished. Oh, hi Portia, looking cute. Now it's time for me to struggle with this diagonal bridge. Let's see how I go. Yay, I did it. I thought that was gonna take me way longer, but woo, look at me go. Now I'm just gonna fix up the shape of this island because it's looking a little bit funky. That actually went okay. I'm slightly impressed. I know it's probably easy for some people, but I have struggled with diagonal bridges. And now I'm gonna do some more terraforming. I'm picturing lots of pretty waterfalls leading into this river. So let's see if I can get this looking pretty. Escaping is done. It's looking very pretty. I'm loving it so far and I've jumped ahead today so we've got the beautiful diagonal bridge. So proud, so proud. Now I'm going to work on filling in this little island and like I said I want the nuptial bell in the middle and I think I'll put some custom designs underneath it. What ones are gonna work? Oh maybe the cherry blossom petals. That will be very fitting with the theme. I'm so happy I'm finally using this bell. It's such a pretty item. Oh, that definitely did not go where I was picturing. Oh, that's so nice. I love that. 
I love that so much. Ooh, what way do we want it facing? Ooh, maybe that way so you can actually see the bell. Yes, that is so pretty. And now I just need to fill this area with lots of flowers. I'm going pink, white, and purple as always. Butterflies, of course, would not be a butterfly garden without those butterfly models. So yeah, let's go ahead and fill the rest of the area in. I think the look I'm going for for this area is pretty much just fill in every space with either a flower, a butterfly, or another item. We just want it really lush and quite crowded. And that's the little island all done for now. It's looking so pretty. I love it. All of my favorite things on one little island. And now I'm going to work on the cliffs behind. Throw in a few trees for height because we haven't really got too much height in this area. And yeah, more shrubs and probably try to chill on the flowers because we have a lot in this area. <laughs> probably don't need to overload the cliffs with them as well. My butterfly garden island is all finished so let's go take a look i've left this area leading up to it unfinished because i don't know what i want yet oh poor biscuit <laughs> don't know what just happened I think he missed a butterfly um anyway yeah I've left this unfinished because I'm not sure how I want it there's no path leading up to it yet but here is the finished butterfly garden I love how it turned out it's a very crowded and overgrown area but I think having the water around it and the cliffs really balance it out so it doesn't look like too much So 
that brings us to the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you think it looks really pretty. If you're feeling inspired, please recreate this. It was quite an easy build. All I did was throw down flowers and butterflies as you saw. So yeah, it's definitely one of those easier builds and it's taking up a decent amount of space on my island. Thanks for watching. Bye.